Hey guys, this video is going to be about security and more specifically the security concerns of having an unlocked bootloader and what you can do to help prevent easy access to all of your data. Now while unlocking the bootloader unleashes a lot of potential, it opens the doors to things like custom recoveries, root, ROMs and kernels, it also poses a security risk. For example, even with your protected lock screen and not having a custom recovery, your phone's data is still accessible for a knowledgeable thief. All the thief would need to do is reboot into the bootloader and flash a custom recovery. They could then use ADB commands to gain access to your phone's data, unless of course you have it encrypted, which is one method you could use to secure your device, but it does take a while and it can sometimes go wrong. Even if you just leave USB debugging on, you can actually execute ADB commands, so the first and most obvious step is to only have USB debugging on when you actually need it. So I'm going to show you a method you can use on Nexus devices to actually secure your data that little bit more. Now on my Nexus 5 here it's running a custom recovery and the bootloader is unlocked and I'll admit this is how I run my Nexus device normally and it would be so easy for someone in the node to get my data if they stole my phone as I described earlier. So basically what we need to do is flash the stock recovery and relock the bootloader. Now relocking the bootloader does not wipe your data, you can actually do this using fastboot using the command fastboot oem lock or you can download this app called boot unlock. Locker, as always the links are in the description. Now let me quickly explain that if a thief had your phone and the bootloader was locked with the stock recovery, he couldn't then install a custom recovery to use ADB without unlocking the bootloader first. And as we know unlocking the bootloader via fastboot wipes all of your data so your data would be gone and therefore safe. So if we open up this app, which does require a root by the way guys, you can see my bootloader is unlocked and it even shows you that my tamper flag is set to tampered. Now some devices have a flag which gets set to on if you unlock the bootloader or modify it in any way and companies like Samsung or Google will know if you've been messing around with it. With this app you can actually reverse those effects here so no one would know that you've been messing with the bootloader at any point. Now the great thing about this app is it lets you lock or unlock the bootloader without wiping the data from your device while Android is still booted. So to secure this device, firstly we're going to need to reflash the stock recovery while the bootloader is unlocked, otherwise it won't let us do it. So I'm going to use Flashify for that, but you could use Fastboot if you like. So this is the stock recovery, you can access it by pressing and holding the power button then the volume up key, but it doesn't really do much for you. All this is going to allow you to do is factory reset and you can actually apply updates using ADB, but that is really about it. So let's go ahead and reboot. So once you have the stock recovery installed, it's now time to lock the bootloader using the app and that's it. I might as well untamper the flag too while I'm here. And the app itself here is hidden behind my lock screen pattern protection so a thief wouldn't be able to unlock the bootloader using the app itself and he can no longer flash a custom recovery either without wiping all of my data first as the bootloader is now locked. And this is what it looks like if you try and flash a custom recovery on a locked bootloader, you can see it fails. So he's going to have to unlock the bootloader via fastboot and consequently that's going to wipe all your data and therefore you won't be able to have access to it. Now obviously right now you can't flash a custom ROM or kernel, so if you decide you want to, you just have to go ahead and use the app to unlock the bootloader. Then you can flash a custom recovery via fastboot or if you're using an app like Flashify, you don't even need to bother unlocking the bootloader. Then just follow the process again to secure the device. It may seem a little long-winded and granted the risk of a thief knowing about fastboot and ADB is slim, but it's a good way to keep your data secure. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Peace out. 